What's good guys, we're back with some more Power League. I didn't want to upload with Worlds going on, because I'm sure everybody was like watching that and they didn't want any more Brawl Stars to watch. Uh, we've gotten back to Legendary 3, but I think today's games are still Legendary 2. We got Hot Zones. Split. Not too confident in the teammates, because one of their names is Crow and Leon, and the other one is Goaded. And Goaded could be alright, but there's no way someone with the name Crow and Leon is going to be good. And their team looks probably better. Oh, we got the AFK ban, of course. It's a classic. Let's see what we got. Sam! I mean, I don't think anyone was going to pick Sam. Sam used to be good on this map, but everyone's a tank counter now. But we'll see. Maybe they had a Sam one trick on their team. So, Cord, decent first pick. I want to see like a, maybe like a Tara or a, something else. Nita, something. Spike, I mean, alright. It's fine. What are we thinking? Goated. Rico into Cord, okay. I mean, Cord's just a good first pick. There's not too much we can do here. I think it's fine. I think yeah, Gale's, Gale's pretty good. He probably just watched World Finals where they pick Gale every game, so he's going with that. They pick Rico. I really want to pick Gray now. Really want to pick Gray. But we could also. We don't want to dynamite into Cord. So I think Gray probably. We'll see who their other brawler is. Buster could. Oh, Buster could also be really good. Ooh, surely Buster, right? I'm not, not, not thinking Sprout into Stew and Cord. That's insane. I think Buster. If he jump pads. Pick jump pad, pick jump pad, pick jump pad. Gooded, pick jump pad. There we go. We got the jump pad. If he sets that up, like, there's not much they can do. I mean, the Cord can play defense on that, but... I don't think they have the DPS to stop the jump pad. And Spike's going to be good on right lane, so... But hopefully he knows that. Hmm. Spike, go that way. Alright, jump pad us in. Oh, that like... You stay over there. Actually, I'll just wait. If he wall breaks, that'd be funny. If he ruined his own Rico's lane. Spike appears to not want to win. Seems to see what's happening over there. Not the best jump. I want to jump in, but I think we have to win this spike as lane first. That's a kill. Good play by Rico. Like, how is he dying to that? Alright. This is fine, it's the worst position. No, that was so close. That was really close. I think we can win that if Spike doesn't, like, I don't know why he was losing to the cord. Especially because cord's on mute, it's not even on the jump. You can just play defense over there. I think they know the jump's coming, I'm gonna try and catch him off guard. Gale puts down the jump, I don't take it, and then I just... Pull them, maybe. I, I kind of want to win Spike his lane first, though. No, I don't want. I don't want to swap. I just want to win you your lane. Like that, yeah. Then Gale sticks over there, maybe. All right, but he only has so many gadgets. I think Spike, you go back to going.
Alright, he's almost out of gadgets. It shouldn't be that bad. They did get a nice stew wall break, though. Alright, I th think that's all his gadgets, right? Then we could just, like, jump in for free. Unless he's on four gadget Rico, which would be very bold. Yeah, there's no more of that. No more gadgets on this guy. Get over there. Alright, miss super from core. That's big. Pull him in. Get the kill. Spike. Interesting. Good super, though. Good super. I think I play over here and then push in. Play defensive super and then get the kill and we just stand in there and win. Yeah. I think I just gotta waste the Rico gadgets down because every time he uses one of those, like once he's out, I can just jump in and there's nothing you can do about it. I also like going right at the beginning, winning the lane for them because Buster's really good over there. It's hard to push into a Buster like without jump or something. So I think Leon, you uh, yeah, Spike, you come this way just to start. Oh, actually, if they're doing that, that's all right. Oh, he wasted gadget without even like getting too much value from it. So he's already down. And we are winning lane over there, so. Jump. Oh, he didn't even get the kill. That's really bad for them. Stu's gonna pop over on me, I think. Just do that. Try and dodge, get plus one percent extra. Alright, we get zone time from that. I don't know if they're even going to try and push. And then we can get more in this zone over here. Nice. They've got no one over here. The Rico's coming there. I don't know why there were like two Rico bullets at once. Did he fire it backwards? Oh, they're out of gadgets. They're all out of gadgets. Yeah, let's pop in together. Oh, he can only meet one of us. He can only meet one of us. Oh, that took my super? Interesting. Well, like... Going together, yeah. Oh, he's doing good though. But can I like just stand right here? Yeah, you can get that kill. You shouldn't be able to kill both of you unless Rico gets a good super. Then I can walk in a straight line and get up here. Stand in front of him so that if he pulls me into the realm, he's good. Yeah, this is just an outdraft to be honest. Lemon and 13. I think the Rico kind of sold with too many gadgets, but... Yeah, we're pretty low in Legendary 2 right now. I got win traded like twice. People are just throwing, or like, fake lagging. There's this one guy who was like, putting up the lag emote, but he was like, moving around normally. It was like, not convincing at all. Dry season against two people with matching names. I mean, it's a pretty common thing, but they might know each other, which would be bad if they have, like, synergy or something. Buster Ban's interesting. Ban Tick. First pick's nice on Bounty, so we can go Nani, because Mandy and Piper are open, so if we go Nani, they can't pick those. Oh my, that's, like, the worst possible pick. Why would he do that? Yeah, we just lose now. I think it's over. I don't see any way we win this game. Like That's just like the worst possible pick you could make, because now they're going to have Nani, and they could probably also grab Mandy, and we just lose. Just so frustrating. That's just such a horrible pick. If they don't take Mandy, I'll probably pick it anyway, because he can only return to sender so many things. I mean, RT. I think RT Mandy. Let me think about it, though. I don't want to pick. I'm not picking Gray into J to Fang, and I'm not listening to the person who took Piper with Nani open. I'm not picking Jean into not. 
I could actually pick Jean, but then they have the Mandy game of their life, so I don't think I can. I gotta take Mandy so they don't. Because giving them Mandy, if they have Mandy into the Jean thing, I mean, I don't hate this that much. I think if we can control the Fang, but just Piper with Nani open is insane. Because if he likes Piper, he can pick Nani, then I'll pick Piper, and then I can give it back to him, because then I can pick Piper with Nani open. Like, with Nani actually on our team. Alright, well, he just really likes Piper, but it's still a really stupid pick, because if you take Nani, then you'll probably end up with Piper as well. Alright, we hit two already. That might it's not a return to sender. Maybe he, they missed the curve and they did pop the return to sender. Oh, I should be on the other... The other gadget. Yeah, because if it was on the other gadget, I could get big hits. I can't just only shoot this guy. But I can't fold it either. I need like a wall break or something. The sad thing is this guy probably thinks he's good at Piper because he has mastery, but that doesn't make you good. Alright, that's fine. Alright, we have Blue Star. We're gonna get lots of control here. Can he even hit me if I'm all the way back here? He can if it's the big thing. Nice. Nice. Are we push up here? Are we push up here? Alright, we auto in the super. No! We don't auto in the super because that throws the game. That's fine. They can't, couldn't push up like that anyway. Here we go. Wasted curve, but. Alright, I don't know why he ran in and died, but. Alright, <laughs> wasted gadget. Our team seems to have a lot of those. Not really that anything of a super. In fact, it's probably better for us, if anything. I just want to not all die, I think. Like, I think if he just does that, and then we can just shoot it, then we're good. It's fine. We're not going to get blue star this time, which is not good. I don't know why we randomly decided to stack my lane. But it's fine, it's fine. Piper's got super already. They are pretty good at Piper. I still think if we pick Nani, it's like, like not even a question whether we win or not. Because then we'll still get Piper anyway, and they can be on Piper. Alright, we just want to get a super, and like, tap Sprout or something. And this Nani's really bad, is the nice thing. Oh, I don't know when they did that. Lane swap, that's on me, 100%. But, I do have super now. If I figure out where they are. Over there. If I can, like, get across. No. Also, somehow, Mandy has super. I mean, Fang has super again. I don't know how that happened. I gotta waste that. I think RT should be over on that lane with Fang. I don't know why RT was on Sprout instead of their best matchup. Yeah, he wanted to super in. I think RT should be like in between all of us so that he can do something against the. Uh, I hate. Oh, that's a kill, right? There you go. I I think if we get Fang, maybe we'll have to get two. I think we just walk in a straight line. We're not gonna boost the KDR more. Oh, if I had like a little bit more time, I could start stacking supers. I don't know what happened at the beginning. We just. <laughs> triple stacked my lane. It's kind of confusing. Interesting play. I didn't play very well, though. I kind of sold the fang because I knew he was there. Like, I guess he 
RT really wants to go that way for some reason. I don't know why. Like, the Fang's on the other side. He's going against his worst matchups. Nice kills. Nice kills. Job all around. I think it kills him anyway. Yep. Perfect. We get control. If you super away. If we stand next to RT, they can't do anything. Like, we need we need RT to always be standing next to us at all times. So the Fang super gets no value. I think I can do that. Get the free kill. We can bait um, Fang super maybe onto the RT. Oh, that's just a cell from that guy. The, the, yeah. Oh, he's gonna get some value there. No, he's the kill. If he doesn't kill me here, okay, yeah. I mean, that, that's what should have happened. Oh, Piper almost just killed himself off of a Nani. Okay, I think we're gonna do that. And then maybe that. Oh, beautiful play. Beautiful play. You gotta switch it up, because if you go the same direction, they're ready for it. That's Nani's fault, 100%. But we're gaining we're gaining back with the randoms threw away. And probably me sometimes as well, but mostly the randoms. Could be NA, could be EU. No idea, to be honest. But it's fun, because Gem Grab, Gem Grab does alright on the EU server. I, if I, It's a lot more positioning, and... If I can get a kill at the end for gem carry, it's much better. But like, bounty knockout on delay is just so much pain. So with my luck, it this it I only get those on delay. So but that means that this might be an A. Yeah, yeah. Nani's good. Nani's good because Piper's open. Apit's banned. It's nice. I mean, Apit doesn't really counter Nani, but it's th this is definitely the best mid to take right away. I don't know why you suggested me ahead of time. I'm, I'm, I can, I'll figure it out based on their two picks. But Nani's Nani's a good good pickup. And hypercharge lose banned. We love that. That's like all of World Finals was day one at least was hypercharge Lou and Gale, which a lot of people are surprised about the Gale. I'm kind of noticing that a certain brawler. Whose name? Oh, I was about to make a joke about Charlie being open, but there's that. So that's fun. I don't really know what we're gonna do about that, to be honest. Don't know how that one got through the draft. I mean, Tar's actually pretty decent into the Charlie. I do like the Char. Actually, I like the Tar a lot because the pets block the pull. I mean, they're probably gonna be trying to pull the Nani and not me. We do have to watch out for Rosa, or we could go at ourselves. I think Rosa would be pretty good, to be honest. Or actually, Jesse. Or no, Sandy, Sandy. Yes, pick Sandy. Please pick Sandy. Don't switch to Jesse. Yes, sir. I think it's pretty good, but we do have to watch it. I think they're going to go Rosa. And I don't know if this guy can figure it out. I've. The TTV guy. I've had a bunch of games where he kind of threw. I think I think every game he's been in my lobby, he's lost. Like whether it's the other team or my team. Yeah, Piper into Nani. He wants to play Tar, I guess. All right. I I think they. I really want to pick TP Nani. TP Nani is like such a. It's like really nice on this map. I know they have Piper, but. I think I'll just use the outrange instead. They have two mids. I don't know what they're going to do on the lanes. I mean, obviously Charlie's going to be on the lane. But then I don't know what you're going to do. Alright, the pings... Alright. Seem to have gone Piper that way. I'll just shoot over that way. And he can just pets. But I think the snappy sniping works off the pets. That's going be annoying. Lots of control already. We always have TP and things get bad. We really don't want to get Charlie supered. We also don't want to let them in here. 
Oh, he missed his curve on me, thankfully. We got webbed. I want to do that to catch him, make him spawn in faster than they expected. Do I want to get pulled? Not the best gadget. Can do that though, that's good. Let me get the Piper here. Alright, I'm gonna do this because. Alright, that was definitely on purpose. And then we knock him back here into us. Stop the healing. Alright. We can do this. I'm like not commentating because I'm like locked in right now. Uh, good pulse. Good retreat. I like that. He's a good player, the tar. I don't want to feed Charlie Super for reset. I think we can back up. I was going to Nani. Zero out well. Oh, it's just a TP on this guy right now. Oh, he's not on curve. That's helpful to know. That means I can't super right in front of him because then he'll knock me back and cancel it. So, for some reason I thought he was on curve. I thought he just tried to curve earlier. But that makes me more glad I'm on TP and not the return to sender. Because return to sender is only necessary for the curve. Otherwise, he'll, he can't really reach me on this matchup. Alright, that's like a 4k on the gene, I think. Yeah, the Sandy's pretty good matchup here. I'm hitting my shots for the most part. There you go. You're down here. Alright, we gotta watch out for that, though. I have no idea where he is. Oh, that was bad by him. He revealed himself for no reason. He's down here. <laughs> Every time I say, oh, he's here, it's always wrong. I'm all Nani super, I think. Maybe just hit the Piper. Finish them all. Actually, I'll just kill the Gene. Do the respawn. Alright, he's got super. I can't do it. He's gonna keep going back up. That's fine. If he supers him. Well, that was good. I got a mix of hitting the web and... Thing. They seem to have gone for the Piper mid. I don't think that's as good as Gene mid. We're gonna move up here. I don't know how many more pets he's gonna have. Had a good pull on Tatar though. And he does have super now, which is bad. I think I can sneak up here on this and just try and kill them. Oh, I shouldn't have revealed I had TP last game, because that would be much better. TP there, so we can get the kill and not get webbed. If he gets super, that's really good. In fact, it's probably better that he dies. Charlie will be down. We, last thing we want to happen is get pulled. Seven? I don't think they can get it in time. Especially if they... Yeah, I don't think two is going to drop in ten seconds. I think we're fine. But you never know. I could get, like, Charlie supered from super far away. I get pulled, but I stay alive. I think it's probably better I get pulled than get hit by two piper shots. No deaths that game, ever for me. I didn't get too many kills, but I got a lot of damage. I think there was some stealing going on from my teammates, or just they were backing up and healing. But 3 0s that's like a super good record for gem grab. Oh, I have him friended, so now he wants to talk about it. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Bye.